another vlog and um, i'm vlogging on my phone because i forgot my camera didn't i but yeah we're just on a dog walk it's a bit chilly today i've got a um skirt and a jumper on but i dress up for a dog walk because obviously i haven't got any makeup on but i thought i'd just put a nice little outfit on good morning mr magpie saw the magpie i already saluted it good afternoon guys so i've just spent the day editing my video with emily which has taken so long to edit I did a little super drug order i haven't got all of it here i thought i'd got rid of the chin spots but i can feel a big one coming it's just so annoying got another pair of soap i didn't even need this but i saw it was blue and blue is my favorite color so i just got it and then i got this intense moisture cream this is a little bit vitamin e collection from superdrug if you have not tried it honestly it's my favorite if you're going to try anything i really 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 recommend vitamin e hydrating mist this is the best i literally use this every single day i've been using it for maybe like two when did i go into reading two years ago from the vitamin e section i also got this facial oil purely because i saw people on twitter talking about this i haven't tried this yet so i'll let you know guys know how it is so i've watched a vlog before i started eating but i've got the texan barbecue from pizza and changed the chicken and bacon out I'm getting kind of full up now though good morning guys today is sunday me and emily have just uploaded our boy talk and girl talk video so i'm just watching emily's now i'm trying to think of like what i can vlog i want this to be like a fun interesting vlog and there's only so much you can do you know um but i love watching just vlogs of people at home i personally think mine are boring but i love watching other people's we haven't been to aldi in like i want to say like three months since like the whole um bulk buying thing started happening so me and my sister went the queue was not bad at all but i got the their gins like, aren't they they just have the best gins and they're like 10 this is 10 pounds this is raspberry and watermelon it's really really yummy and then my sister got rhubarb and custard which literally tastes exactly like rhubarb and custard so it's really really good i think i've just managed to get some insta pics outside against the cherries come out can you see look all of the the still green so i think like end of summer should be good but when they come out ah, oh fucking stuck to me i think that'll make a really really sick picture. i haven't had this drink in so long this used to be my favorite i always used to drink it after school my other favorite one was the pineapple one this or pineapple has got to be my favorite also just watching the martian i, I think i've seen this before but i can't remember it if I have seen it. I've got myself a lovely glass of my watermelon raspberry gin. I've heard they're getting an elderflower one as well, so I'm definitely going to be getting that one when I see it. Happy Monday, everyone. Today is a bank holiday, and I'm currently on another dog walk. It's 22 degrees today. I've got like little white Primark top on, and then this tailor skirt that I literally just got off my mum now. It was my sister's, but I remember this being longer on my sister. I forgot to vlog but we went to the Turkish supermarket I had so much stuff in my hands so I didn't vlog in there but we got Turkish bread hummus which is just the best from the TFC so I'm about to do some tie-dye this is just a white pretty little thing jumper and I actually bought it to tie-dye but I just have not got around to doing it so I'm gonna do it now I'm doing blue done at my tie dye to be fair I don't, oh my god i don't know how the jumpers are gonna, i don't know how the jumper went because i had a bit of like a mishap with it and i also did some nike socks because i tried to do them with purple i'm actually gonna go crazy and um they didn't turn out very well so i've done them again with blue This is the outdoor furniture my mum has. It's from John Lewis. This is my personal favourite, the swinging chair. Kind of like mix and match. My skin is getting really bad at the moment. My camera's flashing red. I don't know why. I think it might be to do with my pill, even though I've never had issues before with my pill. Um, but when I was on my break, it was fine. Like I had chin spots before, can you kind of like see here? And now I'm back on my pill. I've got one here and I'm getting another one there. 
It's Prosecco time. I'm gonna be mixing it with some orange juice. Yum, yum, yum. Moment, we're watching White Lines on episode six. Enjoying it so far? Yeah, I didn't have to juggle off <laughs> watching Sack this alone. She goes to Ibiza <laughs> because they find they a dead body and they think it's her brother. So basically she's gone to Ibiza and it's basically about her, find out what happened to her brother and shit. So I look a bit crazy, um, but I've just put on the ordinary, I think it's like a HA healing solution i'll leave a link to it in the description anyway if you guys want to check out i mean like literally i feel like everyone has it now but i've just put my tie in a wash um i looked at it before and i think there's too much dye on it to be fair when i was doing it, my mum did say do you not want to crump it up enough good morning guys so my camera died yesterday literally as i was vlogging and then um fell asleep watching white lines um, and that's pretty much all I did yesterday, but I didn't get to show you my tie-dye. Put it through the wash twice. So it looks as if my mum has already hung it up. I did some socks as well, which have basically just gone blue, to be honest. Look at it. I would just like to apologise for the way I've looked throughout this vlog. I haven't I've put makeup on the tiniest bit of makeup on like one. Realities of a lockdown, we all get spots. Um, oh, fuck it just fell in my dog's head. So I said I was going to do like a little bit of hamper last night and i didn't i use the ordinary aha i'm gonna use ordinary lactic acid five percent and ha two percent to be honest i don't really like the smell of this but whenever i use it i really like it to be fair i don't use it every day spots on my forehead seem to be on this side of my face another ordinary product this is the caffeine eye solution just basically reduces the appearance of eye contour, pink and pigmentation. I'm just massaging this in. Lastly, this is a tea tree oil, just one from Sabres. So I just pour a bit on my finger. And just rub it in. A bit of Vaseline. That's all I'm going to do for my skincare. I'm hoping my skin is up a little bit in the next few days. I'll show you my tie dye now because I haven't got around to showing it yet. So when I did my tie dyes, I didn't actually rinse it before I put it in the wash because I wanted the rest of the blue to run so it wasn't like blue and white it was like lighter blue and darker blue. I did my blue socks and this is how they turned out. I think they're quite cool to be fair. There's the other one. My jumper. I didn't have high hopes for this as I said before. I kind of like messed it up. So I feel like I washed it but it actually turned out I actually really like it. So this is how the jumper turned out. Do you see what I mean about I wanted the blue to run? So it's not like white and blue it's like a lighter blue and a darker blue. I think it looks so cool for the back. I think I actually prefer the front on this one. I think this is probably the last tie dye I'm gonna do. I don't feel like I'm gonna tie dye any more clothes. Normally I crumple it up a bit more so um, it's kind of sp like spread out. I kind of covered the whole jumper in it. That's why when I first took it out, I was like, oh no. When it first came out of the wash, I was like, mm -mm, no, I've messed it up. But yeah, I actually really like it now. Come around together. Cute. I've got a few more pieces off of my mum. I've got this wrap around skirt. It's just like a beach skirt but I'm just gonna wear it as a normal skirt because I really, really like it. Um, just a little wrap around. It's got a tie there. So this is actually kids, a kids top. Um, I also have another kids top that I wear from like Asda. So this is age 11 slash 12 but it fits and I really really like it. So it's just like a sleeveless green polo but it's got like this white piping on the collar, which is really, really cute. But I know, and yeah, just leave this. I thought this would be really, really nice. And I'm obsessed. I'm literally loving green at the moment. I don't know what it is. Like, I literally, anything green, I'm just drawn towards. Honestly, I have a whole new wardrobe just from like taking stuff off of my mum. This next one, I feel like it's going to be a bit like, hmm. But I am hoping to crop it. I mean, like, my mum didn't want it anyway, so I don't see why she would be bothered about me cropping it. Because I don't like the length of it. That is why I liked it. I think it's just tempted. But it's just got, like, diamantes on it. And then, like, there's, like, this little v-neck bit there. I think long like, long like this, it looks like a pyjama top. But cropped, it looks quite cool. I think it's quite cool. I think once I can, like, crop it, cut it, whatever I'm going to do with it, I think it would look cool. And then the last thing that, I think that was a little... Oh, there's one more thing, but it's literally in the bottom of that tub with all my clean clothes. And it's just like a long uh, cable knit, not long, but like just above your knees, um, brown jumper dress, which is obviously for winter because it's quite thick. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd keep that for winter. And then the last thing was this Lonsdale bag. Um, I showed this to Jed and he didn't actually believe me that I was going to keep it because obviously it is a Lonsdale. I just thought it was a cool little bag and... I might as well just keep it because my mum's only going to throw it out anyway. So, yeah, 
yeah I really like the pink stitching on the handles and stuff as well so yeah that's my little haul done I was meant to finish this yesterday but I carried it on today just because I hadn't showed you my tie dye and stuff um so yeah I'm gonna finish this here I really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you all on Sunday in my next video bye